It was nothing short of a Cinderella story as the Penn State Fayette men's basketball team advanced to the finals in last year's USCAA Basketball National Championships. I was amazing for us. Uh, it was a good experience for everybody. Uh, we never felt anything like that or played in the games like that. The whole stadium was just all packed up. The record crowds that packed the main arena at Penn State Fayette, the Everly campus, made last year's championship run even more special. Athletic Director Vince Capozzi says witnessing the team in action made him proud to be a member of the Penn State staff. Probably the most emotional moment I think I've ever had in athletics was sitting at the scorer's table watching these people come in for the national championship. And I remember looking at our official timer, Dave Reiner, saying, Dave, they're still coming. They're still coming. They're still coming. It was just, it was amazing. And then to see my guys, and it was a great group of guys last year, be able to experience that and get as far as they did. It, it was a very emotional moment for me. The chance to play in the national championships, combined with the opportunity to get a Penn State education, is what brought many of these student athletes to Fayette. Today, they don't regret their decision. I mean, I didn't know about it until I came to one of the games. I didn't know until my senior year I came here and saw, and I was like, this is going on in your backyard? Yeah, I didn't, I didn't even know that. And then coach told me, you know, come here, it's a great experience. And I, when I came here and we made the tournament the first year, it was exciting. Hey, man, it, it was it's just feels great to be a part of that. You know, you got guys like Dave, Pratt, Brandon that step up and just play ball every night. And they was like showing out. And I was like, some way, somehow, I just wanted to be a part of that. And, you know, hitting that big shot in the corner to put us in the finals, I mean, it was just great. This year, the Roaring Lions have lost some players to graduation but the team is just as hungry for a victory in the national championships. We basically started the season with a lot of fresh guys, a lot of guys that didn't have the playing experience that they may have had in high school, uh, but they're adjusting extremely well. Sophomore Spencer Perry have comes to Penn State Fayette from Hawaii. As he adjusts to the Pennsylvania weather, he also becomes a more confident player. Um, I would just like to do my best at Fayette and just uh, contribute to the team as much as possible and just be successful. Sophomore C.J. Gaddis was James Pratt's understudy in last year's championship run. Now he's running the show as point guard. I couldn't say how much James helped me as a player when I first came in. Um, more the mental stuff throughout the season, keeping me under his wing, and he taught me a lot, and it's, and it's paid off throughout the season this year. Junior Derek Jones continues to earn his reputation as the three-point specialist, but he's quick not to take all of the credit. They're doing, they are doing a great job of setting me up. Coach is setting great plays, everything. And I just credit it all to him, our team, our coaching staff, everything. That coaching staff includes assistant coach Jawan Davis and a new addition, David Wins, a star on last year's team. Also providing experience and stability for Penn State Fayette, D.R. Jenkins and Matt McKenna. Jenkins and McKenna were two of the state's best high school athletes years ago. And now they're like older brothers for the team. The Roaring Lions say they owe their success to that family dynamic. This team's number one priority is always um, family oriented, and that's what really made me want to stay here. It's it, you feel like you're really home when you're here. If we just keep playing together and make some shots, we can definitely make a run at the national tournament and the conference tournament for sure. Brian Morozak, USCAA tournament buzz.